What does it mean to lead? Great question for us to, to look at. For a few days, it seems a particularly appropriate given where we are as a nation and uh, what's going on in our world. There's lots of challenges, right? Lots of opportunities for us to step forward, make a difference, influence other people. Lots of ways that we could look at what it means to lead. And Integris, for us, our uh, mission is to increase both the quality and the quantity of leadership in the world. Now, what do you think? Could you use a little bit more leadership where you are in your organization or in your community? Uh, I've yet to meet anybody who says, oh no, we got plenty of that stuff. We got all the leadership we need and it's the best quality. Seems to me there's always more we can do. And so when we um, use this curriculum, the Leadership Challenge, one of the reasons we use it is because this is very practical, actionable, real world application of what can be some rather lofty ideas about what it is to be a leader but we're here to be practical. Now, in some of the organizations I've worked in, this was true. And I don't know if this is true where you work right now, that the only things that seem to happen around there without much effort are friction, confusion, and underperformance. Any, anybody see that? I mean, not with you yourself, of no. course. No. But maybe we see a little bit, bit of that, and if we were to listen to Stephen Drucker, or Peter Drucker, excuse me, the famous leadership guru, he said that if we want anything else, then we have to be able to lead. Now, you'll notice that I use the verb to lead. The first language thing that I would bring up is if you look at the word leadership, what part of speech is the word leadership? Trick no. question. No. It's a noun, correct. And what is a noun? How would you define a noun? A person, place, or thing. Who snapped back to the fourth grade? When you were that? What Miss Stover said to me was a noun is a person, place, or thing. So let's look at leadership as a noun, because it's dissonant, right? First of all, we can say, well, there are leaders, so there are people. But is leadership a, a, a thing, a person, a place, or is it a place or a thing? Leadership? I don't think so. I mean, if it were, if it were a thing, an item, a quantity, a commodity, we could go down to Walmart and buy ourselves a case of leadership and pass it around everything would be great, right? But no, that's not the case. So you will see that we reframe this right away by saying that to lead is a verb. Because leading is all about behavior, it's about what we do. And that changes the way we think about it right away because you're doing things every day that make a difference for other people. The question is, can you do them more? Can you do them more skillfully? Can we find a common language? to talk about leading, because leading belongs to everybody. That's our belief. 